Howdy folks, Jeff here. Nice winter day. Just uh, do a little walk around. Nice to walk out in the snow sometimes. This is mainly the reasons why I'm not doing a lot in the garage to the International, but I do have a furnace in there, so there's really no excuse. There's the old Westphalia, all buttoned up for winter. Wife's Jeep. The box that's going on the International. Loaded up, filled with some junk. Well, not all of it's junk. Look at that, I found beer. Ooh, mmm, beer. It's my little snowblower that I managed to rescue from a friend of mine. Needed an engine, so I just went out and bought one at Princess Auto, which is a lot like the American equivalent of Harbor Freight, for those who don't know what that is. Yeah, that's a barbecue with shocks and pneumatic tires. Hmm. The garage is a mess these days. Get in trouble with YouTube if I got music playing, so here's a little item I picked up today, and it's a little gas tank. Let's see if I can. There we go. Which I'm going to mount in the back of the International. It has a couple more lines on it than I need. Not sure how I'm going to gear it all up yet, but it should hold about 20 liters of fuel. And here's a little rig. That inspired me to. Uh, should say I was inspired to make from another youtuber it's uh, a pneumatic cylinder it's a pneumatic cylinder mounted on this little frame and I believe it was 1963 Impala that has one. I put a flow control unit on mine. It's not hooked to air yet, but essentially this part here will come down. Come on. Like that and clamp your bits and bobs when you need an extra hand. Anyway. I'll have it hooked to a switch that I'll, that I'll put down by my foot. And just to update where the International was, the last video I made, I had this section just welded up, it had a big hole in it. So as you can see, it's uh, now repaired. my shop needs to be cleaned up desperately and this side here has been repaired but it hasn't been ground smooth or cleaned up yet and the bracket needs to be put put on 
So that's all for now, folks. Thanks for joining me, and I'll see you later.